I'm Ashton Auger with the Jennifer Queen Team and Remax Professionals. Today we are in the new and upcoming neighborhood of Canterbury Crossing, Transcona's newest residential neighborhood. If you're looking to build your dream home, this might be the place for you. With tons of pathways and sidewalks connecting the neighborhood together, there is a true community feel here. Canterbury Crossing is a new development located in the far east corner of Winnipeg. This neighborhood is a subdivision of the already existing Canterbury Park and is found in its southeast portion. It is bordered by Ravenhurst Street to the west, Fieldhouse Way to the north, the east perimeter to the east, and Dougald Road to the south. Its proximity to the perimeter makes for easy access for a quick escape to Lake Country or a fast commute throughout Winnipeg. It is located roughly 24 kilometers to the Winnipeg International Airport and roughly 14 kilometers to Winnipeg's downtown core. As you can see, the neighborhood of Canterbury Crossing is only just starting to shape itself into the amazing neighborhood that it'll be. It will be mostly comprised of larger two-story homes with double attached garage and front drive access. The style of these homes will be more traditional, but with the odd modern home tucked in there as well. There are plenty of lots to choose from, from a standard lot to more impressive lake and park view lots. The development will offer a wide variety of housing types such as residential detached, duplexes, as well as multifamily complexes. If you are interested in building in the area, we are happy to connect you to any of the approved builders, which includes some of Winnipeg's best, Randall Homes, Kensington Homes, Broadview Homes, Bluestone Homes, and a &S. Depending on the type of home, the lot, and the finishes, Home prices in this area are starting in the mid 500s and ranging all the way up into the mid 700s. These prices usually don't include the landscaping or a finished basement. There are no hospitals found in the area with the nearest hospital being the Concordia Hospital at a 16 minute drive away. There is no plan for a school to be built in this area, but there are plenty of schools in the surrounding areas to accommodate this new development. Canterbury Crossing is part of the River East Transcona School Division and is in the catchment of the following schools. Harold Hatcher School, which offers programming for children from kindergarten to grade five in English only. Arthur Day Middle School, which offers programming from grade six to eight in English only. Murdoch McKay Collegiate, a high school that offers English only programs from grade nine to 12. Ecole Centrale, which is a French immersion program for students from kindergarten to grade four. Ecole Regent Park, which is a French immersion middle school for students in grades 5 to 8. Ecole Monroe Middle School, which is a dual track middle school, which offers in both English as well as French immersion to students in grades 6 to 8. And Collège Pierre Elliott Trudeau, which is French immersion high school for students from grade 9 to 12. Canterbury Crossing will be made up entirely of residential homes but it is in close proximity to Kildonan Place Shopping Center that offers more than 100 stores and services within its walls. There are also a number of large retail outlets along Regent Avenue, including Costco, Canadian Tire, Winners, Home Depot, Superstore, Walmart, among others. There is also a Safeway only five minutes away located on Kildare Avenue East. Regent Avenue also offers many different options for dining out in the area for a great night out. Canterbury Crossing is located in a well-established area of the city, therefore there are already plenty of amenities for you and your family to enjoy, including the East End Community Centre, Transcona Centennial Pool, Transcona Golf and Country Club, and the Transcona Aquatic Park. 
The area will also be home to a new sports field, a children's playground, and an off-leash dog park. Why I love this neighborhood is because it is part of an already established larger neighborhood with a community center, schools, and amenities. It also has really quick access out to the perimeter and you get to enjoy these beautiful retention ponds. Well, I grew up here, so I lived here for almost 20 years. And Transcona feels like you live in a small town inside a city and everyone's really friendly and there's a lot of parks right outside your house. So it's actually one of the best neighborhoods in the city. It's very quiet, uh, not a lot of crime, not a lot of traffic, uh, lots of friendly neighbors. I mean, I grew up here and it's, it's a great area for kids to grow up in. It's super safe, very kid friendly, lots of, you always have lots of blocks with lots of children on them, so that's why I like it. Yeah, it's pretty good. Nice area. It's not like too busy. It's kind of out of the way a bit. Kind of more rural feeling without being like right in the city. So that's yeah, pretty good. Thank you so much for taking the time to learn more about the neighborhood of Canterbury Crossing. If there's a neighborhood you would like to see featured, please comment below. If you like what you're seeing and you want to learn more about what the Jennifer Queen team has to offer, please hit subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.